So this video is about beta and gamma functions. So we have to prove that beta of m plus 1 comma n is equal to m by m plus n into beta of m comma n. So in order to prove this, so how we have to solve? So we have to go with the important relation between beta and gamma functions. As we know that, so we know that there is an important relation between beta and gamma functions. That is beta of m comma n is equal to this is gamma m into gamma n by gamma of m plus n. So this is the important relation. First of all, we have to show that beta of m plus 1 comma n. So in this relation, if I keep in place of m as m plus 1 comma n and substitute here, then in place of m we have gamma m and in place of m plus 1 I am writing as gamma m plus 1 into gamma n by in place of m here. If I substitute all these in the relation of beta and gamma functions, in place of m we have m plus 1 and again n is uh, common. Therefore, beta of m plus 1 comma n is nothing but. So, this is gamma of m plus 1 gamma n by here it is gamma of m plus n plus 1. As we know that gamma of n plus 1 is nothing but n gamma n. So, this is one of the properties of uh, gamma functions. So, using this property, if we have n plus 1, we can write as n gamma n. So, here we have m plus 1. So, if I use this property here, then beta of m plus 1 comma n can be written as this is m gamma m into gamma n by this is also this is m plus n gamma of m plus n and see what happens here and this will be beta of m plus 1 comma n is equal to m by this is m plus n this is nothing but gamma m into gamma n by gamma of m plus n as you know that this is an important relation gamma m into gamma n by gamma of n plus n can be written as beta of m comma n therefore beta of m plus 1 comma n is equal to m by m plus n into beta of m comma n therefore therefore beta of m plus 1 comma n can be written as m by m plus n into beta of m comma n and this is how we have to prove so here it is so simple that this question is from beta and gamma functions most repeatedly asked a question so it is so simple that beta of m plus 1 comma n can be written as m by m plus 1 into beta of mn so we know that beta of m comma n is equal to gamma m into gamma n by gamma of m plus n so here so we have to show that beta of m plus 1 comma n is equal to this one. So I am starting with beta of m plus 1 comma n. So if I substitute in this relation in place of m we have m plus n. So wherever I find m I am going to write as m plus 1. So after that this is m plus 1 and this can be written as m plus n plus 1. And we have a property that gamma of n plus 1 is equal to n gamma n. So here in place of gamma of m plus 1 I am writing as m gamma n. And in place of this one I am going to write as m plus n gamma of m plus n. So if I take this m by m plus n aside then this will be gamma m into gamma n by gamma of m plus n. So this is nothing but a relation between beta and gamma functions. In place of this I can write as beta of m n. So, in place of this, I wrote beta of mn and this is how we have to prove. So, this is so simple that we have to use um, the important relation between beta and gamma functions. And we have to proceed and we have to use only this property as gamma of n plus 1 is equal to n gamma n. So, this is so simple. If you practice, definitely you can, um, you can solve by your own. And thank you so much for watching. And if you really like, you know what to do, please subscribe. Go through the playlist and it will be very, very useful for your preparation. And thank you so much. And please pass it on, share it with your friends, leave a comment below and subscribe to this channel.